Does your computer feel slow? And you want to increase its performance for gaming and editing? So you are watching right video. These tips will help speed up and increase the performance of Windows 10. If in the end you are happy with your result, please consider the like the video and subscribe the channel. So let's start the video. First create a restore point. If anything goes wrong we can revert them. Go to search and type create a restore point. Simply open it. Now select C drive and then click on configure. Make sure this system protection is turn is on. Now hit apply and then OK. Now click on create. Name it whatever you wish. Then click on create. It will take few seconds. When it done. Now here you can see system restore. If something goes wrong, you simply click here to revert all the changes. Next we have to update our display driver. Go to Windows icon, simply right click on it, and open device manager. Now expand display adapters. Now right click on your driver, and update it. Now click on browse my computer for drivers. Now click on let me pick from a list of available drivers on my computer. Now here select your Intel HD graphic, and then next, it will take some seconds. Now your Intel HD graphics driver is up to date. Now we have to turn off some settings. Simply go to settings. Now go to system. Notification and actions. Simply turn off notification. Now go to multitasking and simply turn off snap windows. Now go back to home and now click on personalization. Click on colors and turn off transparency effects. Now go back to home. Go to apps. In offline maps, simply turn off map updates and then delete all maps. Now go to startup. Now disable all unnecessary program. If you don't know what are unnecessary programs just leave it. And also make sure you don't disable Vanguard if you play Valorant. Now again go back to home. Click on gaming. Make sure this Xbox game bar is turned off. Now go to game mode, and this should be on. Now again go to home, this time go to privacy. In general turn off everything. Then go to diagnostics and feedback. Turn off this, and delete diagnostic data. Now scroll, and go to background apps, and simply turn off background apps by here. This will reduce CPU usage. Now again go to home, click on update and security, delivery optimization, turn off allow downloads from other PCs. Now you can close the settings. Now we have to disable Windows 10 animations. This will help you to reduce system usage. Go to this PC, simply right click and go to its properties. On the right side, go to advanced system setting. Under performance click on settings, change it to custom. Under custom check two options. First show thumbnails instead of icon, and second smooth edges of screen fonts. Now hit apply and then OK. Now your PC animations is disabled. It helped to reduce system usage. Now we have to delete some junk files, which are slowing down your PC for no reason. Hit Windows plus R key on your keyboard, and type TEMP and hit enter, and delete all the files. Don't worry we are deleting only trash file. Now again hit Windows plus R key on your keyboard, and type percent %TEMP% percent and hit enter. Now again delete all the files. If some file doesn't delete just leave it. Now again hit Windows plus R key on your keyboard, and type prefetch, and then hit enter. Now again delete all the files. And also don't forget to delete this recycle bin. Now we have to create a new power plan. Go to battery icon. Simply right click on it, and then click on power option. Now click on create a new power plan. Now set this to high performance. Save this plan as whatever you wish. Then click on next and then create. Next we have to clean our disk. Open file explorer. Then right click on C drive and go to its properties. Under general click on disk clean up. Then simply click on OK and then delete files. Don't worry these are only unnecessary files. Now click on tool, and click on check. A check disk can show you if there are any physical problems with your hard drive. This will take few seconds. 
Now click on optimize, and one by one click all your drive and optimize it. Do this to all your drive, and make sure you don't optimize SSD. Now download this file, link in description. Simply extract with WinRAR. You will get a folder. Simply open it. First open registry optimizations, and simply run both the registry files. And if you want to revert the changes, you can revert by here. Now open batch file optimizations folder, and run the batch file as admin. Now go to programs folder, and install C Cleaner. After that open it. Now simply run the custom scan. It will scan all temporary files, junk files, internet cache, and delete them. Use this once in a month. Now install driver booster. Simply open it, and click on scan. It can help detect and update outdated drivers. It will fix Windows issues, like crash or blue screen of death. Now install memory duct. After that open it, go to files, settings, and check load on system startup. Now let me show you how it's work. Here you can see, I am getting 32% of memory usage. Now click on clean memory, and you can see my memory usage is decrease. Whenever you feel your system getting slow, use memory duct to reduce the memory usage. Now we are done with all steps. Restart your system to apply the changes. These step will increase performance, increase FPS and response time. If you have any question queries or suggestions, you can ask in comment, or you can ask me in Instagram or Discord. And if you are getting frame drop in GTA 5 then watch this video. And if you want to increase FPS in Valorant then watch the right video.